everyone, this is Raimi from Browns Volkswagen and today we're taking a look at the 2020 Golf TSI. The Golf that we're looking at today is shown here in this beautiful metallic gray. Looking at the front, you're going to see the VW logo. In between those front halogen headlights, they are fully automatic headlights and you have LED daytime running lights. You get 16 inch alloy wheels with all weather tires on this vehicle. And you get LED tail lights as well. The side mirrors on this vehicle are heated and they're foldable so they'll go in and out in both directions. You can also see the little icon for your blind spot monitoring there on the inside and these nice turn signals there on the outside. Looking underneath the hood, you're gonna see the 1.4 liter TSI turbocharged four cylinder engine. It's got an eight speed automatic transmission. You can see your fluids here. They're clearly marked. This vehicle is front wheel drive. As we make our way around the back of the vehicle, I'll let you get a look at Maroni label. And coming around the back of the vehicle, we're going to open the trunk and get a look at the space in here. This vehicle conveniently comes with the golf floor mats, which is really nice. And underneath this cover, you're going to see the spare tire, jack, and the tools you'll need to change the tire. If you need more storage space, it's really easy to put down the second row seat. These seats fold down in a 40-60 split, and that's going to greatly increase your cargo space. Sliding inside the second row, there's plenty of leg room. Um, it's very nice sitting back here. These um, black leatherette seats are really, really comfortable. It feels really great back here. You get a nice view of that sunroof as well. Back here, you're gonna get two pockets, your reading lights, and then on each door, you're gonna have space for a cup holder, the controls for your windows, and your speakers in the door as well. And you can also pull this down, get your cup holders, and also have sneaky access to the storage space in the back too. The front passenger seat is very open and spacious as well. There's a really nice glove compartment, great paneling that runs along to your air vents here, plenty of storage space and room for cup holders on the doors as well as your controls for your power locks and your windows. Behind the steering wheel, again lots of leg room back here. The control to adjust the back of your seat's power control for your easy convenience there. And if you need to adjust the steering wheel height, you can do so with this lever right here. On the armrest, you're going to see all of your controls for your windows here. This little knob will let you uh, adjust the side mirrors. You got all of your headlight controls here. And then coming around to look at the cockpit, you're going to see your multifunction display screen there in the middle. And you can change what you see on that screen using the side to side buttons here to toggle through your menus. And once you're inside of menu and you've selected that, press OK and use these up and down arrows to um, click through your options. The rest of the controls on your steering wheel will include all of your cruise control settings here. This button will take you directly to your driving assistance menu there. You have um, your volume controls. And then on this side, once your phone's connected, you can um, use your voice activation controls here, and then as well as control your media there. 
the easy to use touch screen is located here in the middle. The radio button will bring you to your radio settings here. Once you have connected your phone, you're going to be able to utilize your phone from this screen. And you can also uh, plug in your phone and use Android Auto or Apple CarPlay and use that device there. Your regular menu button will pr pretty much just bring you to this home screen and from there you can click on any of these options such as settings to change the time and date and then your vehicle to get the vehicle data and current status. Under your touchscreen you're going to find your climate control zones here and as well as my personal favorite, the front heated seats. There's extra storage space down here with a USB port. And then cup holders here in the middle and a middle console. To utilize the backup camera, put the car into reverse. The camera will click on here and you can back up safely using these nice navigation lines. To utilize and open the sunroof, just push that button and it'll move all the way back. At any point you can stop it by clicking forward and it'll stop where it is and then to close it again just press all the way forward and it'll close on its own and also close this shade as well. You also have your reading lights up there as well as your uh, self-dimming mirror. So that's the 2020 Golf TSI. If you have any questions about this vehicle, please give me a call. Again, my name is Rainy Belsky. I'm with Franz Volkswagen and I can be reached at 804-551-5537. Thank you so much for watching.